Okay, we have a triangle. Uh -huh. So we know two sides and the angle in between. Then we can get the number three side, oh, which is right here. You know what? I'm going to call this one like a C. How about that? C. That's it. So C equals, oh, that's right. So we can use what? Pythagorean theorem, right? So this time I'm going to use a real one, real Pythagorean theorem, right? Okay. C equals, that's right. So C equals, so big square root sign so select this then oh three square plus four square right okay you know what the real one oh that's right minus two times three times four then cosine that angle oh in this case 90 that's it then What's cosine 90? Oh, that's right. That's zero, right? That's why. So we can ignore this one. Then the answer is square root. Then 9 plus 16, which is 25, right? 25, which is 5 inches. Oh, that's why this one is 5, right? Everybody knows this one. That's right. Okay, let's try this one then. Uh-huh. Okay, so we know two sides and one angle in between. Uh-huh. Then we are looking for the other side, which is C. Okay, C equals, oh, same thing. Okay, let's try this one. Okay, so 4 square plus 9 square minus 2 times 4 times 9 times cosine that angle, which is 30. That's it. Then right away, oh, we know cosine 30, right? Cosine 30 is a square root 3 over 2, right? Okay, very simple. So now we can reduce this 2 and maybe this 2. Oh, that's it. That's 36 square root 3, right? Okay, let's calculate. Okay, 4 square, 16, 81. Oh, 97. That's it. 97 then minus oh this one 36 square root 3 36 square root of 3 that's it so inches right there okay this is the law of cosine very famous okay now okay so let's call this one c let's call this one a then how about this one b Okay, then the formula for C equals A squared plus B squared minus 2AB, then cosine that angle. Oh, so I'm going to call this one maybe theta. Okay, then cosine theta. That's it. So one more easy question right here. Uh-huh, so we are looking for the length of a C. Then, oh, two sides, 7 inches and 9 inches, and 60 degrees in between. Aha. Uh -huh. Now, oh, very simple. Square root, then 7 square plus 9 square, then minus 2 times 7, 9, then cosine 60. Oh, very simple. Okay, this time, what is the cosine 60? Oh, that's exactly half, right? Oh, that's half right there. So, what is a half and 2? It's going to be gone, right? Oh, that's it. Just like this. Then, oh, 7 times 9, 63. So, what about this one? 49 and 81, which is 130 minus 63. That's it which is square root of 67 which is about almost 8 point maybe 2 that's it okay so inches okay remember this cosine law oh that's it 